Hey guys, Andrew there, and I've had quite a couple questions about my driver, particularly uh, in YouTube and also my buddies. Um, they all have kind of the same questions about how far I hit it, and I've already answered that question, so I'm gonna kind of get to the nitty gritty stuff about how I hit my driver and uh, how I think about hitting my driver. So, um, I am a pretty unconventional call for when you think of it. Um, I've been criticized quite a bit for my over the top move at the top, but I have gotten better at that. Um, it always wasn't like that, but I just feel like I get having the most control when I'm like that. It's just something I like to do, and I've been criticized by a lot of people actually, but I don't take it as a I think it has kind of constructive criticism and not uh, uh, hurtful criticism if you kind of look at it that way. But um, when I'm hitting my driver, and it's actually a tip that I discovered only a couple days ago, especially when you play in Canada and it's cold out, you want to get as much distance as you can. And uh, one of the things I like to do is close the club face. Just I hear it at um, when you have it uh, behind the ball uh, before you swing. So what this does for me is helps me get a little more of a draw on it uh, in order to kind of uh, get some more rollout, less spin. Uh, but it benefits all kind of sorts of things. Um, I'm not really sure what my numbers are when I'm like that, but um, I can tell you they're pretty good because I do hit it a lot better instead of just keeping it neutral. And although the M1 is a great driver, uh, I, feel, I feel like it's a little bit too spinny when it's at neutral, so that's why I close the face a bit. But um, other than that, I close it like, just a little bit, uh, maybe a couple degrees. That just helps me trap the ball a little better uh, coming from the inside. And it also gets quite a bit more distance and it takes off some of the loft, uh, but you're not really de-lofting the club. You, you really have it neutral, just you have it a little bit closed. And I find that really helps, uh, just for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, it feels really like crisp off the club face, and um, just really works for me, I guess. But yeah, like, this is the best driving tip I can give you if you're looking for that extra 10, 15 yards. Just close the face a little bit. Just swing the same way. If you want, you get a little bit more release into it. That's just gonna help you get a little more draw. Oh, I just busted my teeth. Okay, so I guess that's the end of the video now, so I just broke my teeth. Um, yeah guys, and especially for uh, all my subscribers that live in hotter states, hotter countries, uh, with firm fairways, try this out, because this ball is going to release like crazy. So um, hopefully this benefits you guys in northern states, where it's more wet, more cold, but also in the southern states and countries where um, you get a little bit nicer conditions than I get. So um, thanks for watching the video guys, hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like below if this did get you that extra yardage, and uh, have a good day, bye.